Sorry, my mic was all the way over there. We're back again for some more tea. You know how it is. Try not to flip the truck. Love that for me. All right. Let me share the broadcast. Real quick. Then we can start. I want to see what everybody's voting for right now. They all want me to play Mario Party for the TikTok simulator. Love that for me. That's fun. Okay. So let's get this. Retweet this. Live again. YouTube.com slash Allie Fitz. If you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe today. Join us. Join us. And we are ready to start. How y'all doing? How was everybody? Let me know. Hey, Ali. Hey, Bree. What's up, Asia? How's your day? Andres? Andreas? Did I say it right? My day is good. Alicia, hey. Hey, Lazy Simmer. What's up, everybody? Local artist. Adiri, did I say it right? Imagine Bro. What's up? Okay, let's, let's go. Where'd we leave off? I don't even remember, but I guess we can continue. Oh, wait. Where's my light? Yo, there was like no light. I mean, it was okay, but I like my light. All right, let's try not to flip the truck. You know what I mean? We got this. Hey, Allie, what's up? Nicole, hey, Giselle, what's good? I just got done watching some of your other videos, as you should. Love y'all. Oh, it's almost my birthday. My birthday is September 10th. It's September 8th in this game. Time to start a nice, fresh morning. Top of the morning, P.O. Complaints in Monday mornings. The perfect combo. P.O. Positive <laughs> or that P. Take it away, Bert. Morning, JR. I'm afraid it's a pet P for me again. Okay, People who come camping here. here outside the season just bugger off already. Do you guys remember already. when that girl gave us attitude? Do y'all remember? Don't be shy and flip the truck. Stop it. <laughs> she gave us attitude because we wouldn't do what she wanted us to do. I cannot believe it. If we have to deliver something to her, she better have a better attitude today. Because she can really clock off her job and then go and deliver what she needs to deliver instead of me. I'm not the UPS truck. I'm the mail truck. I only deliver what I'm supposed to. Oops. Not me missing a stop. Oops, I'm on the grass. No biggie. I remember it right. Do a flip, girl. She wild, y'all. Hope your day's going well. It is. It's going really well, because I get to deliver my mail. Do my job. Get paid. Live life. Maybe talk to my... Um, my crush on this game. I don't even remember his name, but I know he's a lumberjack. Watch him not even be a lumberjack. What's up, Emmanuel? She better have an attitude. If she do, you'll see my attitude come out too. I missed the stop. My bad. My bad. This song come on the radio every day. Whoever is singing, she is getting the money. Uh-oh. Guys, we actually do have to deliver to the girl. So, everyone be on your best behaviors. We're on Main Street. So, right here is her package. Here we go. Parallel park. You want me to parallel park? Here, I'll try. How's that? Oh, ooh, ooh, my parallel park skills are trash. In real life and on this game. Hair, there, there. How's that? I guess I can't really just park wherever I want when I'm playing. I need to do better. Here we go. Hey, here's a package for you. Oh, thanks so much, babe. Listen, I owe you an apology. Babe? Now she want to call me babe? You know what? I'm going to let her explain why she, she owes me an apology. I can't talk. Apology? For what? I was Kurt, just plain Kurt. And there you were just trying to talk to me. You deserve better. Andu, I don't know what Kurt means, but I guess that means rude. 
yeah, I do. I mean, I was just trying to talk to you. Or it's okay. No one can be perked up all the time. Or Polly G accepted. Let's move on. Nah. I want to let her know that she was being re rude for no reason. And I was hurt by that. So I was just trying to yeah, talk to you. Yeah, I do. I mean, I was just trying to talk to you. So any idea what caused it? Business is slow. More than slow. I mean, oh, the Flick Shack is in real trouble. That movie box kind of was my last-ditch marketing effort. Nothing's worked so far. Well, you better open up. Oh, I can't say that. Never mind. Um, that's awful. What will you do if the store goes bust? Or I'm sure it'll be fine. Chin up or ouch. I can't imagine or I can't imagine that causes quite a bit of stress. Um, I'm not going to get all up in her business. I'm going to sympathize. Ouch. I can imagine that causes quite a bit of stress. I've had kind of a stressful job situation myself recently, so I can definitely relate. Really? How'd you deal with it? <laughs> I came here. Change of scenery, huh? Yep. Hmm. Beat her up. Anyway, <laughs> enough whining. Let me make up for my stupid behavior and reward you for dealing with my moods, my lady. Reward me? Yep. I've got... Ta-da! Coupons! They're one of the few perks this job has. I get to take myself and a plus one to a free movie of my choice at the new cinema in Astoria. Valid tonight only. We're going to the movie y'all. What, you mean like a date? Or hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me tell TikTok that I'm live. Y'all, this lady trying to go on a date with me after she yelled at me yesterday because I didn't want to deliver something. Cause she's using me for my job. Cause I am a male woman. You know what, what should we do? Come, <laughs> okay, that's perfect. So let me just post this and then y'all tell me what I should do. You mean like a date or wow, a pretty cool perk or thanks, but wouldn't you rather take someone else? Like, I don't know. Cause like, I'm kind of still mad at her for being rude. But at the same time, I wouldn't want to miss the date. That's free stuff. What if she buys me free popcorn? You know what I mean? This Is this a date, right? She switched up so fast and did. I was bored you go live right at the, at the right time. Thanks. I don't trust this. True. I don't either, but free popcorn. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, wow, pretty cool perk. Cause that seems like, oh, I'll go. But at the same time, I'm not like interested, interested anymore. How's that? Wow. Pretty cool perk. It is, isn't it? So what'll it be, Missy? You in or are you out? Um, all right. <laughs> Wait, let me see if I can do a poll in this chat. Do I know how to do that? No, I probably do not. Bruh, I do not. Wait, let me go. Let me see if I can go. Actually, I don't even need a poll at this point. There's only a few of us in here. We know. So what should I do? Should I go? Or should I not? Yes or no? I'll just look at chat because I'm on Streamlabs and Streamlabs doesn't even show. What should I do? Should I go on the date? That's more content. We can see what's going on if we go on this date. We can see how the movie theater looks. Maybe we can take our actual crush to the movies. Someone got a crush, but attitude swings? Nah, right? Go to the date? No? You go? Okay, I'm seeing lots of goes. I'd love to. I'm in. I'd love to. I'm in. I'm in Great. to going. I Pick go. you up at your place at eight. I know where you live. <laughs> anyway, weird. gotta get back to it. Bye. 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 All right. So we're going. She's a bee. She is. But she's gonna buy me popcorn. It's okay, guys. We don't like her. We're just gonna use her like she tried to use us. <laughs> she did try to use us. But also maybe she can be a nice friend. Maybe we can be friends. Like, but I'm not trying to date her. Because she was she tried to use me at the very beginning. I'm trying to date the lumberjack. But he's very closed off. So she's weird. Just a little bit. He didn't lie. Oh, he almost got hit. Sir, don't be walking up on the mail truck, especially mine. Let me deliver this. Ooh, that man almost got his life handed to him in a package. Where am I? East First Street? Period. 
Nah, she weird. I know where you live. Laughs evilly. No. Yeah, and I'm going on a on a get together. I'm gonna call it a get together with her because it ain't no date. Nope. No answer. Damn. She she <laughs> rang the doorbell twice. There you go. Not you try to run him over. No. He walked too fast. I know pedestrians have the right of way, but not today. I'm on the road. Let's continue. This lady's always on the radio, too. Listen to it. Oh, stop sign. See, this is what happens when you follow the um, traffic rules. You'll be able to drive correctly. They want you to slow down, because if you don't slow down, you'll do what I did last time, which was flip your car, or spin around in a vertical position. Ooh, ooh, ooh! Shark turn, y'all. Oops. Oof. These brakes don't work fast enough, bruh. Anyway. We're on Lakeview Boulevard. So this That's lighter than I thought. She can go deliver this to him. Where is he? In the back? Or is he at the door? Maybe he's in the back. Let's check. Allie accidentally on purpose tried to run over that man. <laughs> you know what? Hey, Mr. Mackey. Got another package for you. Ah, oh, Miss Weiss, good seeing you again. You know, getting bored with the mail yet? Yes. <laughs> Did your old man sell you on the job? <laughs> Don't be laughing at me, damn. Okay, you know, I'm actually starting to like it. Or, I'm not convinced, but there's still time. Or, I don't think it's a job for me. I'm not convinced. I'm still not convinced. But, there's still time. Mm, there's always still time. Yeah, sure. Have you kept busy since my last visit? Or, it's good seeing you again after all these years. I'm gonna, you know, try to converse. Have you kept busy since my last visit? Not at all, but that's the point. It's finally off season. Now I don't have to listen to them annoying, screaming children anymore. Pure bliss. Me. <laughs> that's why I'm not a parent. Um, was I once one of those screaming children? Ooh, I need to know the truth. Was I once one of those screaming children? Well, let's just say some kids are a little less annoying than others. Oh, <laughs> I'm glad to hear that. Well, enjoy your peace, Mr. Mackey. See you around. GTA UPS edition. Exactly. That's how I be playing this game. Also, <laughs> not you crashing into the fence and then blaming the car. Yes, it, it was the car's brakes. It was the car's brakes. I wish this girl could run. Literally, this is as fast as I could go. But I guess she wants to enjoy the sights, and we should too. So let me stop being impatient. I'm not Sonic the Hedgehog. I'm Meredith, whatever my last name is. Anyway, let's see what's on the mail radio. Is it vibes? Ooh, it sounds like it's vibes. If it's vibes, click that like button. Okay, we got a couple more spots to be. I think we can go this way and get to those two letters over there. And then make the circle around. So everybody, um, cross your fingers for my driving. Is there a finger crossed emoji if there is? We need to spam that in the chat <laughs> real quick. Good thing there's no one on the road like LA, cause honey, I probably would have flipped this thing into the lake. Music giving SpongeBob. Oh, shoot. There go a letter over here, and I'm missing the spot. That's what I get for reading chat. Don't live stream while you're delivering mail, y'all. Or else you're going to end up like me. Crashing. I'm parking in the middle of the road because there's no one here. Like, I'm not holding up traffic. Here's your mail. There you go. Do I have anything to do today? Oh yeah, the, the date. Oh, not me about to forget the date already. 
Oh, sharp turn. Okay, we made it. It's okay. Don't worry, everyone. We got this. You should run that, ruin that date for that girl. Oh, no, no, no. I can't read. Oh, my gosh. You should run that girl over that we're going on a date with. Why can't I not read today? My contact. They're dry. That's why. I'm going to blame the contacts. Blame everything Ooh, but me. Interesting. So you want me to run that girl over? If she's not already in the, um, in the theater when I pull up. <laughs> Y'all wild. Goofy music. Oh, my God. They need to be playing Ally Fitz on the radio, to be honest. That is who Okay, I'm doing pretty good with my driving today. I wish I could change the radio like GTA, but they said nah. They said you listening to what we want. I hope this is the way to the Lumberjack's house. I love him. That's my man who's not my man. driving a little too fast y'all listen we're okay uh oh uh oh the diner this is where i always have a problem oh 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 Woo! i put my foot on the brake that's exactly why we didn't crash into that truck I'm trying to be a little bit more cautious but honey i got my strawberry daiquiri so you never know there goes somebody hey can I beat? Oh, I should have beat. Oh, 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 oh. Woo, that was close. Campground. I remember dad telling me, Meredith, the picnic area is for the older kids. I think I was 17 when I had my first actual picnic here. Hey, girl. Have some mail for you. Hi, sweet Meredith. Hi there. Here's the mail. Thanks. You're on your own today? On your own today? Sorta. Mickey's in the RV. He hardly slept last night. Said he had hallucinations of rotten fish in the RV. Huh? Did he have too much of the stuff that makes you feel funny? Yes. Well, actually, when I went outside this morning, there was this huge rotting lake trout right below our window. Totally grossed me out. How does something like that end up there? Ew, disgusting. Yeah, that's gross. Um, you know what? Wait, she may have a suspicion? What? I may have... Uh, hold on, Mickey's gotta read this. <laughs> Mickey, wake up, honey. Leave me alone. I'm still shit-faced. It's a letter from Damien. Oh, right. Yeah, okay. Give me that. Looks like we won't be here much longer. Where are you going? Oh, really? Where are you going? We're going to Canada. We will be picked up this Thursday, early in the morning. For good? I like her, though. Canada? She's cool. For good? Joan? Are you running your mouth again? I'm sorry, sweet Meredith. Gotta go. Hey, you know what? Are y'all fugitives? You should come by Wednesday. Our last night here. We'll build a campfire, have a drink, maybe a puff or two. Hey. You know, and talk about the meaning of life, of course. She invited me. A complete outdoors experience. She invited me, y'all. Why not? Oh, cool. Yeah, why not? I'm making plans. Joan! Awesome. Make friends. Gotta run. See you Wednesday after sundown. Bye. Oh, yay. I got some friends before they leave. Y'all, look, I'm becoming known all over the town. I met with the lumberjack. I met with the, I'm meeting with that one girl tonight. I'm meeting with them on Wednesday. I'm out here. Oops. Oh, he gonna be so mad at me. Crashing his uh beloved. Alright, let's go. Oh, 
I didn't stop at the stop sign, but don't say anything. If you if you click the like button, you're going to tell the cops. That's telling the cops. Are you going to tell the cops on me? Do it. <laughs> go ahead. Go ahead. Click the like button because honestly, I just should have stopped at the stop sign. I'm about to pass this car because they're going too slow. Excuse me. <gasps> That's exactly why you don't cross on the double line. On the double yellow lines, don't cross. Because you'll end up like what just happened to me. Let me be careful. Not this guy again. I don't like this dude because last time I delivered to him, he was playing video games and didn't pay me any attention. It was kind of rude. What on earth did these folks order? Here you go. I'm gonna try one more time with this guy. Hello, sir? It's the mail. Excuse me, what's this all about? It's about the mail. It's all about the mail. I'd appreciate it if parcels are not just dumped on the counter. Well, where do you want them? I'd appreciate it if you'd act like a human being. You'd understand if you had any idea about what I'm trying to do here. Setting up a computer system to handle all the bookings is quite sophisticated. This man's playing video games. Are you sure you're not just playing a game? Yeah, I'm sure. Thanks for the mail. Bye. Goodbye. We're not friends, ever. Rush! But at least I'm off the clock. Glad he was my first delivery, or last delivery and not my first. You know what, is this his car? If this is his car, that's for him to deal with when he gets off the clock. And if this is his car, both of these people have something to deal with. My bad to the person whose car had nothing to do with it. Anyway. Movies tonight? Yes, I think movies is tonight. I think she invited me on that date tonight. So I need to figure out how to get home. But if it wasn't, well, somebody's gonna have a dent in their car. And we just, I hope there were no cameras. Oh, pretty. Go to driver's ed before you flip the truck for the third time? Mm, no, nah, I'm good. I'll be okay. I feel like I'm going in the biggest circle in the world just to get back home. And I think I need it. But look at the pretty view. Pay attention to that. I wish I could turn the music up some. Oh, everybody get out the way. I'm on the wrong side of the road. This thing don't turn as sharp as my car. Stay on the yellow line. There's that girl who fixes the car. I wish she could put like some extra speed on this thing. That'd be dope, but I know she can't. Oh, speed limit's 25. Honey, I do not care. They go to my parents' house. And now we can clock off. Sharp turn. Ooh. I'm doing better with my sharp turn. No more flipping over. Oops, spoke too soon. Uh-oh. Car going a little slower now. Ooh, we're gonna have to take this thing to the mechanics soon. But it's time for the date. Right? It's today, right? Hello? Hey, Meredith. How was your day at the office? Uh, I mean, 
mail truck. Maybe it's tomorrow. Oh, hey, Dad. Um, it was a normal day, nothing special. It was a normal day, nothing special. Okay, your mom and I are waiting for the hotel bar to open. Thought we'd check in on Me. you. Me. Living it up. Living it up, huh? Are you boozing every evening? <laughs> Easy now. It's just a nice convenience. We found a payphone at this bar. Oh, mom's poking me. I guess she's mad. I blew her cover. Here she comes. Wow. Hey, Meredith. Don't listen to dad. We will only have one or two drinks. Hi, mom. It's okay, mom. It's okay, mom. I like a drink every now and then as well. Me. Alcohol is fine, but I'm changing the subject. Have you met that new guy at the hotel yet, Matt? Yeah, I met him the other day. Quite a character. He's, uh, a unique character. Unique? <laughs> I guess that's one way to put it. He's one of the reasons why I won't miss working at the hotel. Anyway, how's life in good old P.O.? You know what? It is boring. Not very eventful. After work, I watch TV and read books. Oh, honey, you should get out more. There must be something else to do besides that. I'm trying. I'm making plans. Yeah, Mom, I know. I'll try. Okay, dear. I just want what's best for you. I know, Mom, but I'm all grown up. And now I'm changing the subject. Period. Uh, how are, how you, are you guys doing over there? Oh, Florida is fantastic. I think I might actually want to live here. The warmth of the sun, it's very easy to get used to. Oh, Dad is telling me to get back. Looks like the bar's open. Huh? Wonder what he's ordering this time. I'll get an Alabama Slammer. What is that? <laughs> Alabama what? Alabama Slammers! Cheers! Are they turning up? Oh, they turning up. Oh my gosh, we're going to the movies. I knew it was tonight. This is fun. It's been ages since I've been to the movies. Well, they call it the movies, plural. But of course, we can only see one movie at a time. So, which one will it be? Scary! You know what? I'm picking. My pick? All right, let's see. She asked me. Big Trouble in Little China, Blue Velvet, or The Great Mouse Detective? Uh, what? I wanted something scary, but also The Great Mouse Detective. That sound, that sound dope. But At give least me give guidance. me some guidance though, like... Uh, what about this one? What do you know about Big Trouble in Little China? It's supposed to be a pretty good ass-kicking. Most John Carpenter movies are pretty exciting, at least. He's the guy who made Halloween and The Thing. <gasps> oh! Nothing too deep, but should be entertaining. He made Halloween? Count me in. What's Blue Velvet about? Apparently it's noir, with a surrealist twist. I once saw a film by this director called Eraserhead, which was, well, weird. Unsettling, too. Unsettling. From what I've heard, this new one is quite memorable as well. I love unsettling movies. Heard anything about The Great Mouse Detective? <laughs> Disney movie, Mouse Detective. What do you need? A road map? You're right. All right, I'm ready to pick. I want to see Blue Velvet. Blue Velvet. Good choice. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> Do people in this love turtlenecks? They must. I mean, I'm kind of speechless. And that's rare for me. It certainly was something. I loved it. Oh, they saw and it? And I never want to see it ever again. Oh, they saw it. <laughs> yeah, that about covers it. It's certainly singular. At one point, I did begin to wonder, do you think Providence Oaks has a seedy underbelly? Don't think so. Ew. Haven't found any ears lying around during my rounds. <laughs> well, give it time. So anyway, my parents' house is right down this road, as you well know. Yeah, let's move. Uh, you can't take anything seriously. <laughs> you can't take anything seriously, can you? I'm sorry, still stuck in that movie vibe. Next time, we'll do something in your area of expertise. T. 
You mean driving around in a mail truck? Sure. Park it anywhere around the lake and then just enjoy the sunset. Oh. We can either we can either say we like the sound of next time or being like mm, next time I don't know I don't know should we keep her on our toes and be like I don't know I don't know or do or do we be like I like the sound of next time I don't really like the sound of next time to be real even though we saw a good movie but uh I'm trying to get with the lumberjack to be honest but she won another date. But I'm scared that if I go on another date with her, she's going to be like, oh, she liked me. Skip her. Next time. Next time is a little presumptuous, by the way. <laughs> Oops, what a slip of the tongue. Oh. Got her. So, here we are. Now what? Dang, she want to come into my house. I'm sorry, but I am tired. Or, well, we could have a cup of tea at my place. She wants to come in my house, but, like, honestly, I'm trying to get the lumberjack girl. So I am tired. What do y'all think? I think I am tired. I am tired. Let her in. But I'm tired. Okay, just for tea. I'm thinking about it. Should I do it? Let her in? Okay, just for tea. Just for tea. Just for tea. Just for tea. Well, we could have a cup of tea at my place. But if she falls in love I with me, it's y'all fault. I would like that. <gasps> Ooh. See what I mean? <laughs> so wait. We have a moment, y'all. We can we can think about this, and we can this defines our character. So we can either kiss her and lead her on, even though we I want the lumberjack. We could be the talk of the town. We can get with everybody, or we can just let her go. I you know me in video games. I'm down to do whatever, but I think I, this is not what I had in mind because I want the lumberjack. Don't talk to me. Not what I had in mind. No? Okay. I'm sorry, but this isn't what I had in mind. Oh, uh, okay, fine. Uh, no, that's fine. I, sh I should go. Sorry. See you later, okay? Okay. Good night, babe. Babe. It's babe for me. Ooh. My birthday is September 10th. Oh my gosh, it's almost my birthday. Only Meredith, can I bug you for a second? Yeah, what's up? Sure, Frank. What's up? That Walter Morgan guy. Uh, what did he want from you? Uh, he was asking questions. He was asking all sorts of questions. Also about you, Frank. God damn it. Can you believe that jerk? Are you in trouble, bro? Because you need to let me know. Are you in trouble, Frank? Trouble? <laughs> They're the ones who are in trouble. I gotta get back to it, Meredith. Have a great day. Oh, before I forget, that Robert Harris guy was here this morning, looking for you. He asked if you could drop by. He's working somewhere in the forest today. The lumberjack? Oh, say less. The lumberjack invited me over. Oh, I wanna skip my job right now. I just wanna go to the lumberjack. Oh my god. Good morning, P.O. P.O. Positive? Oh, I'm so excited. That's Oops. Will it be a P or a double P? Walter Morgan has the answer. Every now and then, I spend some time in Providence Oaks, and I'm always happy to see this beautiful and orderly village and its well-mannered inhabitants. Did someone just call me well-mannered? <laughs> I'll take it. Let's see if the weather will behave today. Yes, it better. So we need to deliver this. He DTF. <laughs> the lumberjack? You think so? Oh my gosh. If he tried to kiss me, I'm kissing him. Nope. No answer. How many 
things I gotta deliver today. I'm annoyed. Oh no, not her again. After we done told her that we not trying to date her, we have to deliver another package. This is so awkward. Oh, that's heavier than I thought. There we go. Hey. Oh, hey you. Hi. <gasps> so I'm guessing you wanna rent a movie, huh? We've got a great selection. It was a hug for me. Actually, that's not what I'm here for at all. Wait, you're not telling me you're here for little old me. <laughs> so, what's on your mind, babe? Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Girl, I was here to deliver a package. I didn't know I was going to be stealing or spilling my feelings. Well, I like you, but I think we should be just friends. Or I think I'm starting to like you a lot. Okay, so, hey, Brie. I think I should just let her know that I'm trying to get with the Lumberjack. Because I am. Lumberjack, I'm coming for you. Well, I like you, but and she I got think attitude we should just be friends. I see. I, ca I came on a little too strong. It's been known to happen. Uh. Uh. I prefer to slow it down. Oh, but wait, she'll think that I have, I like her a little bit. I mean, like, she, I do like you, but just not in that way. I do like you, just not in that way. Gotcha. Friends it is. So anyway, Yikes. what's on your mind? You look a little distracted. <sighs> yeah, uh, I just, you ever get the feeling you're not where you need to be? Uh, yeah, like in the job that I am right now. Yeah, I know that feeling. I know it all too well. It's just that this whole Flick Shack adventure, I think it was the right idea at the wrong time. Dang. Wow, is business that bad? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. So your movie box project didn't turn things around? <laughs> it almost did. Don't think that it didn't help. Maybe That's I what I mean with the wrong time. I'm sure video will be huge. But it isn't. Not yet. Not here, anyway. So you're leaving? Yeah. Yes, I am. Wow. I, I didn't realize until just now that I'd already made my mind up. But I guess I have. I'm leaving. Gosh, it feels so liberating to say. She leaving? <laughs> well, there it is. Oh. There it is. How about you? Have you made your mind up yet? Uh, about your future, I mean? Uh, no. Me? No, not yet. Well, take your time. I want to give it my full attention when you do decide. And right now, I really have to start organizing the grand closing of the Flick Shack. We hardly knew ye. I hear ya. I'll swing by later. It's the hugs for me. She really is leaving. She said, okay, well, she rejected me, so I'm out of here. Well, it's not my problem. <gasps> oh, not the cops. I'm sorry. Yo, I was just delivering something. My bad. Have a nice day. Big yikes. Big yikes. Bye. I love this song. Bye. <gasps> the way he didn't see it. Won't he do it? Anyway, cop wasn't paying attention. He was probably looking at some um, donuts or something. Nope. No 
behind, sir. That's for y'all. She out here stalking folks. The girl. Why are you driving so chaotically when the cops are right behind you? I don't know. I don't know why I did that. I just want to see if they were going to get me. But I guess they don't care. Here's your mail. Doing a great job. Except my driving. Could use some help. But it's okay. On my face. I'm about to start singing this song they got on this radio. Oops. These damn signs. Oh. I'm trying to jam. And I can't even jam to the music because I'd be running this stuff. Jackson Streets. I got something for you. It seems Jackson Street is over here. So, here you go. Go ahead and lay this down. All right, down. I'll leave it on the doorstep. Because don't nobody ever want to be home. Here's your mail as well. Oh, it's not your mail? Oh. It must be your mail. There we go. Only got a few more left. Love that for us. If she doesn't stop running into these damn signs, I know, I know. I need to do better. Ooh. There we go. How's that? They need a backup camera on this thing. Uh oh, uh oh. Okay, there's the cops. Let me stop at this stop sign. Did they pull someone over or is it traffic? What are they doing? Is, is he pulling over all of them? None of my business. Did he pull over like four cars at once? Hmm. I guess we'll hear it on the news later. Got some mail for you. Actually, I think it's you. Get in the right lane, you right. Period. pretty good right now, right? Beautiful. Oh, it's these turns. Up. That was good. Here's your mail. I wish I could just throw it like the, the paper boy. Alright, so I'm going to go this way and take care of this package. The way she changed lanes right after you said that. <laughs> Look, I'm doing good. Watch me stop and stop. Okay, look at that. That was beautiful. This thing goes too slow for me. There. How's that, y'all? Okay, so this is not a parking spot, but I made it one today. Oh, the package. You'd think I would know by now. You can't forget the package, ma'am. Where are we, Lake Road? That's lighter than I thought. Get this thing in here. Ooh. Delivery oh. for you. 
See? The box says Mrs. Evans. I remembered. <laughs> I thought I might as well give it to you now instead of, you know, waiting till you're home. Oh, thanks. That's super amazing. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, what is it? Oh my god. I'm so excited about this. <laughs> I see. This is a guessing game. All right. Is it a... Uh, is it... A new rocket? A new rocket? No, but that would totally make Grace's day, though. I should be able to craft something like that out of the cardboard packaging. Good idea. You're welcome. Okay. The suspense is killing me. The suspense is killing me. Open it. Okay, you ready? Yeah. It's actually a Yamaha DX7 synthesizer. Oh. Oh, man, I am super stoked this arrived so soon. I got this amazing deal on it through the classifieds. This old guy was selling it. Apparently, he had never really used it. I mean, what? How? Can you imagine owning something like this and not using it every moment you get? I mean, this synth is used everywhere these days. So I was like, yes, this is mine. <laughs> Sorry, I can get carried away about this kind of stuff. I'm happy that you're happy. No kidding. To be honest, you lost me around the time you opened the box. But if it works like a computer, sign me up. Computers, eh? Oh, wait, are you a programmer? Because if you are, you should totally check out the Insonic Mirage. If you like sampling machines, you should totally try out programming. I'm trying to be her friend oh, again. Man. I would love to. So much to do, so little time. Listen, Em, I totally owe you for lugging this around for me. What about a private tour of our old lake hangouts? I usually take a walk in the afternoon and I have tomorrow off, so I'll probably friend? hang around the watchtower a bit. So maybe meet me there when you're done. Yes. Sure, sounds fun. Great, looking everyone. forward to it. And thanks again. No problem. Have fun with your synthesizer. I hope I don't yes, double book. thanks. You know, hang out with somebody on the same day. I'm supposed to hang out with somebody else. Ooh, that'd be crazy. By the way, make sure you guys follow my TikTok because I'm going to be on there soon. As soon as I finish this delivery and everything. Um, I'm going to be on TikTok playing probably Mario Party. On there at 6 p.m. Pacific time, 9 p.m. Eastern time. Well, around 6 p.m. It's going to be fun. I don't want you to miss it. And if you do miss it, don't worry, because we do this all the time. We stream all the time. Around 6 p.m. Pacific time. 9 p.m. Eastern time. Bully, please. Look, we playing Mario Party that people have spoken on Twitter. When you playing Bully again? Um, probably, I don't know. If not this coming week, next, I don't know. It just, I don't like that it crashes on me. That makes me mad. It makes me not want to play it. But I know I have to finish it sometime. So I'll probably play it this week. I won't miss it, I promise. You a real one. Thank you. We gonna have fun. Does the person live over here? Like, I'm confused. We in the woods. We in the actual woods. can't get mail out here because I don't know if I'm going to be coming out here anymore. About to crash my damn vehicle! See what I mean? They asking for too much. Oh! They don't need to put that tree there! Oh my god. Who even lives here? This don't even look like a house. Wait, where's the package? A chainsaw? 
Oh, let me get about this area for the chainsaw mask and get me. Cause no, ma'am. All right, I'll leave it on the doorstep. Here. Let me All right, get out of here. on to the next one. What do you mean the next one? I'm done. I'm going to go meet my man who's not my man. I try it up. They shouldn't deliver mail out or have mail delivered out here in the forest. Especially by me. Maybe UPS. Not my little old mail truck. Sharp turns, y'all. Hey! Nobody ever want to beat back? Like, I'm in a good mood. I'm in a silly, goofy mood. And they don't want to beat. sure I was supposed to take that turn this map be so confusing to me I think I was supposed to take a turn up here uh oh watch out for the rocks oh oh that car saw me embarrassing oh child yeah cause my man live out here in the woods too yep I knew I was supposed to turn Cause right here, that's how you know you're getting close to my man house. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, he want me to go in the forest. Is he gonna try to kill me? I don't really know him that well. Now I'm kind of scared. And he got a. Dude, he got a chainsaw. Um. Hey, Meredith, I'm up here. Hey, Robert. Wow, that's really high. What? I can't hear you. Maybe you should come down. Maybe you should come down. Sorry, I can't hear you. Maybe I should come down first. Yeah. Yeah, maybe you should come on down. Yeah, because that looks dangerous. Can you hear me now? Hi, Meredith. Yeah. Hi, Robert. That's better indeed. Thanks for coming out here. This arborist job came up suddenly. I'm Yikes. Like I'm glad there's people like you for that. It's great up there. I used to climb a lot. Still do, actually. But now I get paid for it, too. Anyways, I figure it would also be good for you to see where the apartments are planned. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, okay. So, what now? Well, I want you to listen to my wild card plan. Tell me all about it. Tell me all about it. I've scheduled a recording session at a professional sound studio. Oh. Um, right. And then? Well, we'll start jamming. Some music producer accidentally drives by, offers us a contract on the spot. <laughs> Next stop, rich and famous. Let's do it. Let's do it. I got big dreams. When and where is it? Rock and roll. It's this afternoon at Jack Reynolds' barn. It'll actually be a radio message to get the people in Providence Oaks involved. He's serious. A professional sound studio, huh? All right. Okay, I'm in. Great. Meet me there after work. I'm going to get back up in this tree now. See you later. He was serious. Bye. Be careful. I care about your well-being. Bye. Be careful up there. Thanks. He invited me. I'm excited. Let me go clock off. 
I'm very excited. We're gonna have to do that next time though. But I'm super happy. You guys, I know you guys. He's definitely nice to you guys. And he, if he doesn't, he's gonna like me after um we do whatever we're doing. Sing? like me. I don't need to drive this thing to my man's house. Uh-oh, it's going slow. Okay, so that one really did something to, to my car. Oh, I'm going to have to... Look at the stop sign. I'm going to have to take it by that girl's house so she can repair it. crashing listen if you if you knew those sharp turns on this thing where as trash as they were you understand you understand maybe <gasps> okay folks it's showtime Robert are you ready yes but before we start I'm not a pro so please bear with me I didn't know it was today you'll do great you'll do great Okay, Robert, take it away. <clears throat> Fellow Providence Okians, I'm Robert Harris, and I oppose the plans for new apartments on Lakeview Drive. Oh. If you feel the same, let Town Hall know about it and give them a call. Let's keep Providence Oaks pretty. Perfect. Yeah. That's a wrap, folks. Back to work. Hold on. Hold on, Jack. Meredith, what do you think? Uh, you know what? It needs more passion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The text is fine, but I miss a revolutionary vibe. It needs more passion. Um, uh, okay. You might be right. Mm -hmm. Jack, one more recording, please. Sure, Robert. Here we go in one, two, three. Action! Fellow Providence Okians, I'm Robert Harris, and I oppose the plans for new apartments on Lakeview Drive. If you feel the same, let Town Hall know about it and give them a call. Let's keep Providence Oaks pretty. I like that. Better? Yes. Yeah, that should do it. Okay, that's a wrap. Back to tater harvesting. Meredith, I'm gonna return the favor and help Jack out today. If you lovebirds wanted to spend more time together, she can come along too. Plenty of work to do. Jack, what the? Oh, you know what? Let's go. Nothing wrong with a bit of hard work like outdoors. Him. Let's go. Rock on. Let's do this. Okay, to. folks, hop on my tractor. It's time for the real show. I only did this for him. Meredith, it's me. Oh, hi, Steve. Hi, Steve. I'm sorry. Didn't get the chance to look at the contracts yet. Oh, you didn't? I'll look at them. I've been busy. I'm just very busy. Sorry. All right. Hey, uh, I gotta run. Corporate lawyer appointment. Bye. Oh, he mad. Okay. Review Steve's contract. Stay home and watch TV or stay home and read a book. Uh, let me get to these contracts, bruh. All right. Here we go again. I'm not trying to be doing that all night. <gasps> it's my birthday, uh, September 10th. Ah. Good morning, Miss Weiss. Oh, good morning. Good morning, Mr. Morning. 
I need to inform you that your colleague Frank Coleman has been suspended. What? Frank? Suspended? Why? The only thing you need to know right now is that I will be filling his spot for the time being. All right. But where is Frank now? Frank is not here. But I'm a little worried about him. Where is he if he's not here? Somewhere else. Have a nice day, Miss Weiss. Whoa. Not to leave us on a cliffhanger, but what the heck? What's Frank doing? This is sketchy. I like how it's getting, like, more tea as we continue. But if you enjoyed this playthrough and want more, make sure you give it a thumbs up so I know to go live and do it again. I had a good time. This was fun. I don't even know what to expect with this game. Like, is it drama? Is it just fun? Or is it, like, scary? I don't know. But I will see some of you guys on the TikTok stream around 6 p.m.-ish. I might be a little late, but you'll you'll see me. I'll be on. Don't worry. And we'll probably play Mario Party. I love you. Be awesome. Stay lit. You're amazing. Goodbye, my friend. And I can't believe Frank got suspended. I wonder what the heck he be doing.